The next part of field goal progression is working on your footwork, just specifically on your footwork, a drill that works on your footwork. There's a couple of those that you can do. Let me give you the most complex one, but it works good for younger kids because they don't have to dribble the ball. We put both players right here on the baseline. And remember our rule is that you always jump off the, or hop off the foot closest to the basket and land with a quick stop. So the footwork they're working on, they put the ball in the shooting pocket, carry it in the shooting pocket, and we go to those five spots again and shoot a shot, and we just go in a circle, called circle shot. So I'd go here, take the shot, exaggerate, go pick up the ball, go to the back of the line. Next time I come around, I'm gonna shoot one on the 45 off the backboard, then the rim, backboard and rim again. Circle shots. Carrying the ball. Uh, they don't have to worry about the pass. They don't have to worry about the dribble. They're just working on footwork. What they're doing is, is just a footwork drill alone. Now this is a, a drill that where you really, if you're starting teaching young players, it really works good because they get a lot of repetitions at different spots and you're combining soft touch or killer shots with their footwork. Hopping off the basket side foot. All right, now let's come back the other way. Hop off the right foot this time and take your shot. Just a footwork drill. Now this can be a special part of, pro pro of progression for some players or you can use it for all players. Okay, let's stop there. All right, now, one other footwork drill that I really like is I picked this up from Dan Hayes of Oklahoma Christian. Let's come up here. This is a free throw footwork drill, and we want to work on uh, footwork off the pass. You start on this side, and you just face to the other elbow and try to give yourself a two-hand, underhand pass over to this elbow area and use proper footwork. And again, five, so you'd go over here, over here, over here, over here, and back again. Do five, just working on your footwork, not taking the shot, don't take the shot. Don't take the shot, just do it, just the footwork only. Okay, good. Now, when you just, just go over and then come back the same way. Go over, okay, and then come back the same way. Good. Now this again, five repetitions, you reviewed your footwork going to your right, you reviewed the footwork going to your left. One final footwork drill I'll show you is, let's go down here on the three-point line. If you have a team or a larger number of players, you can work on the same thing, work on your footwork first. I call this work the arc and work on your footwork. So when you're going around you can stay on the outside of the arc. Half the team could be over here coming back. Why don't you go over there, Kyle? And you're working the inside of the arc. So you go around once and then come back once. So you've worked going to your right and you've worked going to your left. And all you're doing now, when you get here, here's one thing you can add on this. When you're working the arc and working on your footwork, you add a shot fake to test your balance, to make sure you have a good, foot position so you can do a, a short one inch shot fake, stay down, keep your heels down, and keep your balance. So you're checking your footwork and your balance as you're going around. Go. No, toss a two-handed underhand pass. Two-handed underhand pass. Now you make a good two-handed underhand pass out to you. Good. And all the way around, then work the other side of the arc coming back. A little shot fake on each one, so you check your bounce. Get your heel down. Get your heel down. Get your heel down. Get your weight on your whole foot. Okay, then after that, then they're ready, really, to work on shots off a pass. Now let me give you the other footwork drill for shots off a dribble. So let's start over here again. Let's work the arc first. Same thing, and you're really not trying to get anywhere. Uh, advanced players can go somewhere on the drive. We're going to our right, working the outside of the arc. And what we're trying to do is get to the point where as our last step hits,
that last hard dribble comes down so you end up with exactly the same footwork for shooting off the dribble as you do shooting off the pass. So we're going around uh, with uh, shots off the dribble going to our right. Go. And a shot fake. Again, check, check your shot fake. Check your balance. Good, Kyle, that's better. It's a way to keep your heel down. Okay, come back on the inside of the arc. Now work your other hand. Last dribble is a hard dribble at the same time as your hopping foot is made. One of the best ones, I think, is spin pass shooting. So you can spin pass away from the basket, catch the ball, face the basket, either with your feet in the air or not, and then just take shots off the pass. Okay, let's just spread out and take shots in your range. Now that's just, this is game shots. Now, now what we're trying to work on is game shots at game spots at game speed. So the last part of your progression is to do simulate game competition. They put it all together. All right, now spin pass further out next time and then dribble drive. Take a pull-up shot. Shot fake, dribble drive. All right, 